The German Me 262 was a formidable fighter. Its speed and firepower made it a highly effective interceptor, despite having serious flaws, especially in its engines. Pilots generally praised it for its flight performance, but landing it was arguably the most dangerous part. Not only were pilots vulnerable to Allied fighters, but they also had to manage the throttles very carefully. When coming in for a landing, you had to commit to it. Aborting the approach and quickly throttling back up wasn't really an option. The ME262's Yumo 004 engines had a critical weakness. If you open the throttle too quickly, you risked flooding the combustion chamber with unburned fuel. The fuel could then spill into the turbine and exhaust. A small amount would simply ignite, producing visible flames at the back, which of course is not a good thing, but it's not that big of a problem. It became serious when too much fuel accumulated, which could lead to turbine overheating, combustion instability, and even a flameout potentially causing severe engine damage. However, in more extreme cases, the unburned fuel could enter the compressor cooling ducts where bleed air was used to cool the blades. If the fuel ignited there, it would cause a massive fire inside the cooling system, leading to a blade rupture and catastrophic engine failure. So, for the pilot, every landing was a high-stakes gamble, especially when you also had to worry about being stalked by an enemy fighter.